welcome to the Nico Els Golf Academy. Today we want to talk a little bit about how to chip around the greens and apply a little bit more bounce on the golf club. We see a lot of amateurs that actually uses the leading edge getting too steep onto the ball to try and actually lift the golf ball. And what we normally talk about bounce is, is actually the bottom part of the golf club which is actually up as a central point and not as a leading edge. So if we're looking at what leading edge is, is that most people use the front bit of the club and actually trying to get too steep into the ball or trying to get on top of the golf ball. So I've actually set up a little um, example here with two baskets and an alignment stick to actually help you to actually achieve on getting more bounce into the ball and actually keep a shallower swing path. So as we set up, we took a ball and we took a line where you can see that the shaft angle doesn't really want to come across where the two baskets are and the alignment of my feet because this helps me to come too steep actually in this position. So what we're trying to achieve is just trying to keep the wrist nice and passive on the forward direction is trying not to break the wrist too early because breaking the wrist creates steepness again. So what we're trying to do is just trying to keep the angle straight and simple, no wrist break, keeping the club right in front of us so it feels like a one piece takeaway. Now this little gadget I put down on the floor helps us not to achieve that. So as you can see in the backswing, my club head stays in line in front of me on the follow through does exactly the same. This helps me not to come across hitting into the basket creating steepness. So by swinging backwards keeping the club in front of me helps me to achieve more bounce. We'll do that once more time to understand that we want to go straight forward, keep the club in the same path, use the shoulder movements, keep the club in front, not coming across or bounces up and the ball goes fairly straight. That helps us to understand what bounce is doing. We want to keep the club very shallow, shallow not steep in the wrist position but much more shallower in the takeaway, shallower in the forward swing. I hope this actually helps you guys to actually achieve this exercise. It's plain and simple. You can grab two baskets from the pro shop with an alignment stick. Hope to see you next week for more tips. Thank you for joining Nico Els Golf Academy. Have a great week of practicing golf. Cheers.